Hello everyone. When you pray, you should wait. Huh? When you pray for something, wait for your prayer to be answered. So pray and wait. Pray and wait. Pray and wait. And you may say, Kevin, why are you saying this over and over again? So that it can get into your mind. I think some people have very little patience. They may believe inside of their mind if they don't see evidence of what they have prayed for in less than a week, then prayer is not for them. And that is ridiculous. That makes no sense. Pray and wait. And you may say to me, how long should I wait? Uncle Kev. Okay. Wait, wait a day. Wait. I mean, wait some hours. Wait a day. Wait a week. Wait a year. Two years. Three years. Five years. Pray and wait. Wait as long as you have to. There is something I am praying for. And I don't see visual evidence of it. Does that mean it is not going to happen? I believe it has happened even though I don't see it. Just because I don't see it doesn't mean it won't happen. Does it mean it has not already happened? Does it? I have prayed for so many things and there are times when my prayers, or should I say there are times when many of my prayers get answered. As far as I know, when I get confirmation that they have been answered, sometimes I may not get confirmation like all of them don't happen at the same time when it comes down to me getting confirmation if that makes any sense. So I can't say that this prayer is going to take an hour. This other prayer is going to take two weeks. Pray as if, pray and believe it has already happened, even though you don't see evidence of it. And you may say to me, Kevin, that is strange that is weird you are insane you should not be making videos listen that is faith praying for something and believing it has already happened that is faith something happened or something was happening actually it is still happening and me and this other person was praying for God to give us answers, for God to reveal to us what is happening. And do you know, <laughs> I believe he revealed what is happening. Maybe not in the exact way you may expect, but I would say in parts and pieces, he has been revealing 
what has been and what is going on. Maybe not in full, but I would say, I guess, parts and pieces. So God does. And I was really shocked. I was still am. Am I still? Yes. I am still shocked. God does answer prayers. He really does. I remember, when was it? Last year, me and this other person was praying about something. And maybe, I'm serious now, I'm serious. Maybe in, I guess, two or three weeks, I believe our prayers about a certain thing was answered. I am telling you, God is amazing. Pray and wait. Pray and wait. Yes, there may be some prayers I have prayed for and I don't see visual evidence that it has been prayed. I mean, that it has been answered, prayed. But am I sitting back saying, God did not do it, it is not going to happen? I am not saying that. Even though I don't see evidence of it, I still believe it has happened. Why? Because that is faith. The whole fact I don't see earthly evidence of it means I have to use faith and believe it has happened even though I don't have evidence of it. That is faith. I hope this makes sense now. So don't sit back over there, Kevin. I prayed and I waited for five minutes and God did not do it. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Five minutes. <laughs> Kevin, I waited two seconds and God did not do it. So I started to doubt and say, God is not going to do it. So I am going to do it myself and continue messing up and go in this cycle of failure, continuing to run into the same pit over and over and over again. Why? Why? Pray and wait. Pray and wait. Let me say this too. When you pray to God, not saying that you are going to do everything right. I'm not saying that you are going to do everything right. I'm not saying that. but strive for perfection while you pray. I believe doing that is going to help you. When you pray, don't doubt. Excuse me. When you pray, believe what you have prayed for has already happened. So you pray, so yeah. So you pray and wait. When you pray, and before you pray too, strive for perfection. I hope this is making sense. And when you pray, don't doubt. So what did I say? I believe I said, pray and wait. When you pray, don't doubt before and during and after you pray, strive for perfection, not saying you are going to be perfect. So, <laughs> pray and wait. Pray and wait. Yes, I am saying this over and over and over again because some people may not understand this concept. Pray and wait. Pray and wait. 
learn patience, learn endurance, learn, uh, what is that? Perseverance, is that the word I want to use? That word came to my mind. Maybe that is a word I want to use. I don't know, but let me stop here. May God bless you.